But with regards to in the entertainment world, guess what? After almost two years or a year of speculation right now, Bruce Jenner is coming out to talk in his two-hour interview with Diane Sawyer that will be airing in the U.S. on the 24th of April. He reveals all about his transition into being uh, becoming a woman, uh, what people have been saying about him putting on makeup, painting his nails, growing out his hair, and apparently also rumors that he had a breast uh, enhancement Am surgery. Am I in denial? Yeah, well. is this really happening? I've just been I, ignoring I it as, as complete. Complete. I don't know. But hey, Lloyd, we've, been, we've been seeing these signs with the long hair and yeah, you know. yeah like it, obviously they, I think it's 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 kind yeah. of been a, a big topic of debate yeah. and a lot of people have been speculating about it. But he's coming out to actually have a full-on two-hour interview about it so that he can I guess tell the world exactly what's been happening so that people can stop spreading rumors. I, I suppose Absolutely. in some way at least the family is prepared for the media storm that will happen. Yeah. Um, undoubtedly yeah. they've learned how to protect each other. They they will circle the wagons and it's um, yeah we can only wish them all the best. But yeah. it, it will be nice to know exactly what's going on. I think like. Like everyone else, we we kind of hanging Indeed. onto that headline. Indeed, yeah, exactly. And then some other news. I mean, I've, I know that you're a big Destiny Child fan. Come big on, time, dude, Destiny man. Child fan, dude. They are awesome. But I mean, they are. They actually want to do a reunion tour. Yeah, they actually yeah. want to get Goodness. get back together. Exactly. Now they were they were seen. They they performed together two weeks ago um, in Las Vegas. Mm -hmm. And before that, last time they were seen together was at the halftime show at the Super Bowl in 2013. Wow. But now they are planning a full-on 10-year reunion tour um, and also to cut years. a reunion album. So that'd be cool to see. As well. Yeah, man, it'd be cool to see Beyonce, Kelly Rowland, Michelle Williams all back Dude. together again. But the only thing is they can't perform under Destiny's Child. Why not? Because of the involvement, involvement of Beyonce's father, Matthew Knowles. I mean, he will benefit from them. And obviously they don't want to because he used to manage their, their yes. solo ah. careers as well as um, the group's career. And if they, they perform under Destiny's Child, I mean, he then he will get the money. royalties for it. I hope exactly. they'll still be able to perform some of their, their old classic songs. They I mean, what, what's, a, what's yeah. a Destiny's Child uh, concert without Ladies, leave your man at home. <laughs> the club is full of fellas and their pockets are like... I, I, I just I I can't remember. Ping, I just dun, cannot ping, believe dun, that it's dun, been 10 years. 10 years. Well, you know what? I mean, whether or not, whether or not they perform under the Destiny's Child or not, it would be nice to see the three of them back yeah, together again. Be great. Mm. Yeah. Well, someone who I think is going to be hoping for, for millions more royalties to come his way. Um, of course, Trevor Noah has really shot into the limelight over the last week. Through a lot of hard work, he has wormed his <laughs> way into the driving seat of The Daily Show. He had a lot of flack last week as people went back over his Twitter and Facebook Facebook accounts to, to kind of dig up some of his old tweets. Um, he was being, even as far as being called an um, anti-Semite. So yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, what is great is the South African Jewish community has come out in support of him, saying that this is his kind of humour. Mary Cluck um, from the Jewish Board of Deputies says, uh, you know, fair game, he's that kind of comic. Yeah. He's just poking fun and they wish him all the best. Of luck. Awesome. So well done, awesome. Trevor. Indeed. Well, we celebrate being South African proudly so, and yeah. especially with guys like Trevor Noah doing his very proud. Well, listen, on this Tuesday morning, we're going to play out with one of my favorite artist right now. Her name is Sia. Incredible voice. And here she is with Smile. So smile and have a lovely Cheers, day. Cheers, guys. We love you. Sintana Nogamakaya.